Hi, I'm Karen and you won't see me before because I'm usually the other side of this camera taking photographs and videos of Philippa demonstrating her beautiful kits and also the videos of my daughter Katie who's been doing learning how to do cruel work over the summer and sharing their experiences with you. I've watched them do so many videos. We've done over 200 videos since lockdown started in the UK in March. Um, and I think I've learned quite a bit of the theory of how to do cruel work. But now, how much can I put that theory into practice? Which I think is the thing that Philippa is quite amused about. Just have, have I learned anything of the last sort of seven or eight months of cruel work videos? Well, we'll see today. The project I'm going to be doing is one of the Christmas stockings and we made more than 40 videos over the summer, Philippa doing three through four different um, designs of stockings for her grandchildren um, and now you're, you're about, these are available as printed linens which is brilliant so I, I don't have to draw anything on so that's great. I, I'm ahead of the game now, I'm ahead of the game, um, and I've also printed off the design, uh, sort of the, the guide to, uh, to, to this particular one. Um, and the first thing we'll have to do is this laden couch work. I didn't know that was called laden couch work until uh, to this summer, so that's one thing I did learn. So I know it's laden couch work, and I know I need to put it onto this hoop, and this is where I need to put the hoop. So let's see if I can... I've, if I can do any better than Katie did the first time she did it. Now remember, Philippa says, this, you'll hear me say this an awful lot, Philippa says, unscrew that a little bit, have that screw end towards your, your tummy, then put the plastic over, the saran wrap as it's known in America, and I keep referring it to it as that instead of cling film, uh, put that over, now I'm going to have that towards me when I'm stitching. So therefore, I want that to be that side. So it's away from me of stitching. Oh, disappeared behind that. Right, let's have a look. Now then, the other thing that Philip is really good at is doing this thing where she, she lifts everything up and sees if it looks right. Yeah, I think that could be okay. That, I'm hoping that's right anyway. I'm sure when Katie comes back, she will tell me if I've done it wrong. The other thing is to keep that stick down, keep everything at this end so the nut end of it is to that end and gently ease it in. Oh, that's, so, that's not as easy as it sounds, is it? Just, I'll just undo that knot just a little bit, just a little bit more. And I've got stronger hands than, than Katie. <laughs> I'm going to have to stand up, sorry. Yeah. Oh, it's gone in. Woo, woo, woo. Then Philippa always says, tight, protect the hands, use the base. Oh, oh it works. Oh, 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 this is so exciting. <laughs> this is so exciting. Watch it be in the wrong space. Now you're going to be the first to see if it's in the wrong space. Oh, it's not. It's not, I don't think. I can start going across there, can I? Oh, it goes off the edge. Oh, maybe do it again. Yeah, I think I'll do that again. Let's do that again. <laughs> that was really exciting though. It actually worked. So the placement of the material is obviously a very important bit. How do you get this out? No one showed me how to get it out. <laughs> right, let's have another crack at this. We can do it. We can do it. Yes, we can. Now then, reusing, reusing this cling film. There we go. Very sticky cling film. So I want to try and get, this is an eight inch hoop. I've got the, the largest hoop. So that goes on there like that. That's that. That's in the right position. Let's have a go. Oh, it's going in beautifully again. Standing up again. Whoa. this time let's hope this time let's have a look yes 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 yes, yes. Ooh. so Philippa, katie how did i do did i do okay um so next bit is to start that switching 